What's up guys, it's King Josh back with another video, and as you guys saw by the intro, I did hit 94 overall finally. It took so long because I kind of stopped playing my career, it's been getting a lot more boring to me. But anyway, today I'm going to be playing threes with Randy and Shaquem. Make sure to go subscribe to both of them, the links will be in the description, so I'd appreciate if you could give them a sub. We're going to be playing against some really bad people, as you can see, this guy's record in the middle it's 3 and 69. That is a really bad win percentage. That's like a 5 win percentage or a 4 or something like that. I don't even want to know. That's how bad it is. To start the game off, Randy's going to give me the ball. I'm going to drive right past this guy, get a reverse dunk on two people, and I'm going to fall down. This game might have been the easiest game of the year, but this guy's a little faster than me. He's a shot creator. He gets a wide open mid range, and he somehow bricks it. No idea how, but Shaquem's going to pass to me. I'm going to get a nice reverse dunk. The next play, their center's going to get the ball. He's going to put up a bad shot. Shaquem gets the block, and he's on the break. He's going to pull up for three, and he actually passes out of it. Gives me a wide open layup. And I wanted to get takeover this game, but I kind of gave up on it because I was only halfway. And we had already scored 11, so Randy's going to drive and pass out to me. I shoot the three, and I somehow hit it. My three-pointer is in the low 60s. But I can still hit pretty well. And in these next two plays, these guys played horrible defense. This guy gives Randy a wide open dunk. And then the next play, right after that, they're going to give Shaquem a wide open three. This very next play, I tried to get the steal to win the game. I actually did not end up getting it. But this guy passes to the center. I don't know what he's doing. I get the board. Randy's all the way down on the break. I'm going to pass to him. He fakes his guy out, and he gets an easy layup for the game. Next game, the same people decided to pull up on us. So since I hit 94 overall, I was trying to get takeover this game, see what the playmaker takeover can do. As you can see, I get an easy layup to start the game off. And watch this play right here. This guy takes a layup on Shaquem. I get the block. I don't know if these guys played worse this game or the game before. They just can't seem to create any offense. Like this guy takes a shot. It looks open and he misses it. And Randy's wide open on the break. So he's going to get a nice dunk. And like I said, they can't create offense. This center's a pure rim protector. He's going to take a lightly contested mid-range shot. And on the break, Shaquem throws a flashy pass. I don't know what the heck he's doing. He's a stretch. And he's out here throwing flashy passes. But anyway, I have the ball. I'm going to get a nice spin into the paint, take a nice dunk. And you can see I'm really close to takeover. The next play, Randy let me run point. So I decided to take this guy into the post. Post spin. He jumps. I get a post hop shot and my bar flips. But I still end up making it. And I do finally have takeover. Time to break some ankles. Nope. 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 Kobe. Nope. Nope. I guess my takeover was kind of useful because I got an assist off of it and I could have gotten one here, but Randy wanted to pull the corner three and he ends the game. In the last game, we had two pro ones and an elite one pull up on us. I had to guard the elite one. And they had two sharpshooters and then one post scorer. To start things off, me and Randy did a cross. I tried to get him open in the corner. It kind of didn't work, but he does do some dribble moves. He drives right past this guy and gets an easy, wide open reverse layup. Right after that, this playmaking sharpshooter pulls from deep. I don't know what he was doing. He misses, Shaquem gets the rebound, and they do foul. And I guess I cheesed by accident because the backflip got me behind half court and I got a wide open cut. And this game, playing defense was kind of rough for me because off the ball, I just had to chase this sharp around. Like right here, he's going to get kind of open. It's a side contest. He does miss, but the center does get the board and he's going to put up an easy dunk. This next play, there was actually a mismatch, so I decided to do a post spin on the sharp, get an easy dunk. And I just abused that mismatch all game because normally in park, I play at the three. But today, I was actually playing at the two because Shaquem has a seven foot stretch big. So they're going to bring it down the court. And for some reason, they had the pure sharp bringing up the ball. But it kind of worked. He got a wide open three and the other sharp actually misses. So I'm on the break. I see Randy cutting. He's going to dunk on the center and on the sharp. And like I said before defense this game was a pain my guy didn't even have the ball for most of the time but look at this off the ball they're trying to get him an open three and i kind of got behind him so it made him move up to a two which is good and this center is just setting screens and i actually did get stuck there he's gonna green the three and right here we're only up by three now defense this game was such a struggle this guy was just trying to dribble through screens me and shakim have a nice switch right there but we kind of got some miscommunications on defense 
The Sharp got wide open from half court. I don't know why he pulled it from there though. And their center ends up getting the rebound, but he steps out of bounds. At this point, we were back on offense and we just wanted to expand our lead. So Randy drives in, the center plays help defense, and that's gonna leave Shaquem wide open for an easy three pointer. And like I said multiple times already, this is the only thing they were doing on offense. They gave the sharp the ball, tried to get him open, or they gave the other sharp the ball and tried to get this sharp open off the ball. But as you can see, I was clamping him. We do end up getting the steal, and Randy's gonna get a nice fast break dunk. Next possession, they had the sharp bring up the ball and they were just setting screens again. So he kind of got open there, I jumped, and then he got open there and I jumped again, lightly contested it, and the ball does go out of bounds. But you know Randy had to get his good hustle points. Watch my IQ this play. So I'm gonna fake drive into the paint, do a spin out to get the center on me, get Shaquem wide open. He kind of missed the shot, but Randy gets the rebound and puts up the easy layup. And right here, I don't know if they gave up, but the center just passed it in and I was in the passing lane. So I'm going to get the steal. I'm going to hit Randy. He's going to pull up for three and he hits it. On the next play, when they were on offense, they actually did get an offensive three seconds. And right here, I don't know what I did, but I didn't mean to suit this shot. I meant to drive in and I do end up hitting it. And the weird thing about this game was we won 22 to five, but at one point we were up eight to five. That's going to be it for the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to drop a like. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. We're so close to 3,000 subscribers. I think I'm like 25 away right now. Something like that. But I want to hit 3,000 subscribers before Friday. So make sure to subscribe. Once again, thank you guys for watching and I'm out. Peace.